So anyway, while I was looking for a nut to go on that, I noticed this little piece and I thought, you know, it'd make a pretty good looking little tail piece if it had some holes drilled in it. So I'm gonna drill some holes in it. We're gonna see if it'll make a good tail. Man loses his drill chuck. Man spends 10 minutes or so looking for his drill chuck. Wondering what he's gonna do if he don't find his drill chuck. Man finds drill chuck and we continue. Dang, I said. Thing again. Okay. This is a tiny little, tiny, tiny, tiny little drill. I don't even know if it'll work or not. Well, I say I don't know if it'll work. I don't know how sharp it's going to be. It's tiny enough. That's what we need here. We need a tiny one. Where can I put that where I won't lose it? Right there, maybe? Maybe. My nose is getting cold here. Alrighty, you notice I'm using the most careful type of measurements here. off by about a half a fingernail right there it's still off a little bit you don't have to be perfect but it helps it helps if it's kind of close anyway okay try that that may be a broke a broke off drill bit that ain't gonna work Ain't doing much, is it? Mm. Ain't spoken though. Let's get us a let's get us a little better drill bit than that. Let's see what we can find. Let's try this one here. That looks promising. There's one hole. I think y'all missed the point when that drill bit broke. I think that was just about the time the battery died. It didn't break off in there though. Well, it broke off leaving the shaft up inside the uh, drill press. I think I can get that out. Probably need to oil this thing up too. Let's see how this one here works. I need to uh, get some oil up inside this this drill chuck head thing. Get out of line there. You moving on me? You running around on me, are you? All right, that's two holes. that one too. I might be able to get that one up in the shaft there. Still use it though. There's still quite a little bit left on there.
All right, we got one more to go. Uh, next thing I'm going to do is get me a banjo string, a big one, and drag it through that thing and uh, take the rough edges off it, deburr it a little bit with a banjo, with a big banjo string. I think I can do that right here better than any place else. Then I do with this string is just pull it in the hole and just do some of this. Just try to take the rough edges off. So that that won't cut a string when you wrap it up on one. I might could do something like that with a little drill bit too. A little sideways drilling in there. <laughs> 